In the mogul. In 2012, the military is going to get a lot more awesome. First up, Universal is sinking $200 million into a film version of the board game Battleship. And the movie is going to look amazing since as little of that money as possible has been spent on actors. Yes, Battleship will star Taylor Kitsch from Friday Night Lights and X-Men Origins Wolverine, Alexander Skarsgård from HBO's True Blood, supermodel Brooklyn Decker, and singing sensation Rihanna in her acting debut. Liam Neeson also stars in an effort to give the film some gravitas and legitimate badassery. Now, Battleship is about the Navy responding to an alien attack without all the gritty downer realism of the similarly plotted Battle Los Angeles. So the question is, do audiences like their military movies to keep it real or fantastic? Paramount is betting fantastic as they've just hired the director of Step Up 2 and 3 and Justin Bieber Never Say Never, John Chu, to direct G.I. Joe 2. Chu's resume has nothing but dance movies, and none of them have performed particularly well at the box office. So what does he possibly have to offer the G.I. Joe franchise? Maybe because he's one of the few directors who gets Channing Tatum? But Tatum hasn't agreed to come back yet, and if he bails, who will want to take his place? Justin Bieber? Hey, Rihanna is starring in Battleship. So what do you think of this new direction for war movies? Do you prefer your war movies real or fantastic? And would you be willing to see either of these war movies? Write your thoughts down below. I'm Grace Randolph, and this has been a Movie Bite. Check out more right now.